Today is November 5th, 2023. It's 10.05 p.m. It's a Sunday. Uh, my time as a dishwasher and prep cook uh, is essentially... Um, it has essentially been solidified, which is good. Which is good. Uh, all that running around during the summertime, uh, getting things and putting there and running around and uh, just just running around like a, I mean, with uh, it, it was intense during the summertime because it's busy. Now that I'm completely focused on being a, a dishwasher and a prep cook, and so that means that I have a pretty good idea what I will be doing each day. And uh, all I have to do is wash the dishes and and um, and do the prep and uh, just mind my own business for the next several more years. Uh, I figure that this is gonna take, uh, now it may not, uh, it, most likely it's not going to take 10 years because I'm, I'm w learning from a guy who has, who has spent 10 years on, uh, studying this thing. And so I paid money so that I would not spend 10 years uh, learning what he knows. <clears throat> so I'm sitting in this chair, uh, this chair. I mean, it's this chair just like this. It's a chair just like that. If I had one of those, if I had one of those uh, gaming chairs, I suppose, one of those gaming chairs, nice, plush, comfortable chairs, uh, nice, plush, comfortable chairs, maybe this, maybe I would feel a bit more comfortable. Uh, but that's the way it is, and uh, the body must endure this, uh, this. A marathon okay and I mentioned marathon because there's like uh, what's that like a Boston Marathon or something and I heard it's very difficult to get in <laughs> apparently there are rules that you have to follow and if you carry a certain bag with certain health conditions you're not you're not allowed to carry that in there apparently when you're when you're struggling through that 26 point some odd miles so my ex-wife, uh, when we met for the second time around, um, again I was not ready. Um, I was not ready to receive her in a way that she deserves, and we parted again. But hopefully, third a third time will be a charm. And she told me that she was in a marathon, and uh, the things that she had to endure, uh, I could not imagine. Uh, myself running a marathon without proper training, but apparently she finished. That's a 26 mile uh, marathon. That's uh, that's incredible. So as I, as I sit here, uh, I know that I have to pay the dues. I have to I have to pay the due. I have to pay the dues in order to in order to become what I want to become. And, and and this is not an this is not a free ride. I can't I can't get a free ride. And one of the things that pops into my mind is that uh, it's it's very very simple. It's like these scientists who are who who found these things like the chemical principles, the the cosmic principles. There's and there's those, there's this physics principles and mathematical principles uh the material th things and philosophical things to to come to a conclusion has 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 taken millennium eons for people to acquire that information and understanding the principles of certain disciplines 
uh, within the field of sports and uh, and uh, uh, academics like mathematics and physics and uh, language and things like that. Even if I see it, even if I see it in written form, I, I would have to contrast to see what the differences are and then and then create create a find uh, find these things through discovery of what what these things mean and so <coughs> and so there is essentially a very very hard work that's involved and I'm 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 paying the dues I'm paying the dues in order to get to the promised land and my body is aching uh, uh, and I'm and I'm I'm essentially very thankful that my car is still holding it together my body is still holding it together my mind is still holding it together and and the other day uh, my the owner and the boss reminded me of something he said something like he reminded me he, he said this a while back and says uh, you know that comment that i made about uh something something and uh and and he said yeah that was jesus christ um walking all the way now uh now he's walking all the way all right <laughs> definitely definitely uh, and my body's feeling it my body right now at the age of 54 is feeling it uh, my um, my subscription to the membership to UK spreading will most likely end and uh, and one of the videos that the that Mark uh, sent an email to, he says, "Okay, watch this video," uh, and it's about it's about the challenges of falling down and, and setbacks. And and this guy who used to be a marine or something, and and he's he's he used to be a supervisor, and he says that. Uh, his subordinate would come over and says, "Oh, look, something horrible happened." And uh, and this marine says, "Good. Okay, we can do it again. It's an opportunity to uh, do something better." That's what he said. So anything that has catastrophic consequences, like setbacks and drawbacks and drawdowns, it's an opportunity to to grow. That's what he said. It says good. So I will take that with me and continue on. My body's ache. My neck is like, oh, uh, boy, right now, my neck is like hurting like crazy. Uh, I, need to, I need to shave my head here. That'll last me for maybe uh, another two to three weeks. And... Uh, Keep on chugging away and pay that due.